Hi, this is James Jeffers. I'm a developer on the Catello team, and today I'm going to demonstrate some of the things we've been working on as far as supporting uh, Pulp Core uh, YUM repositories in Content View and filtering those content views. So as you can see, we've got Pulp Core support for a file, a Docker, and today we're going to be looking at YUM. This is using the Pulp RPM plugin, at least version 3.3.2. Now I've already created a repo, a YUM repo, and I've synced it. And I've created this content view called demo3. Go ahead and add that. And look at our list. Oops. So I need to add that repository. There we go. There's our repository. Let's add some filters. So the first kind of filter is we can, let's call this one package because I'm going to create a package filter. I'm going to create it as an inclusion type. So what this means is I can establish a named package. It's going to match that pattern. And show matching content. It should match that and include it in our published version. So let's do that. Let's publish the new version. All right, it's list one package. We can look the list of packages for this content view version. There it is, there's the, the trout package. Uh, let's go back to our filters and let's remove that. Let's create a new one. And this time I'm gonna make it an exclusion. So I'm gonna specify packages to leave out. Let's go ahead and add that rule. And this time I'm gonna filter out packages that match the name walrus. And there's two, there's version 071 and version 521. So I'm gonna publish. And it's done. Okay, so it lists 30 packages. Let's see, we should not see Walrus. And sure enough, would have been right here. They're not listed. Uh, we can modify uh, that ex a, a, any of the package filters. In this case, I don't want all versions. Let's say I just want to get anything greater than version one. Greater than version one. Let's make sure. Yep. Okay. So we should filter out Walrus 521. We'll leave the other one in. So let's publish this version. Tell it a chance to do its thing. Okay. It looks promising. 31 packages, one more than before. And if we look at our list, sure enough, Walrus 071 is included, but the other one, version 5, is not, because that was the filter. Let's go ahead and that one. Let's make a new one. Let's filter by errata. And I can say, let's select this one. And let's publish a new filter. All right, let's see. RPM packages, penguin, shark, and walrus, because those were indicated by the errata. And if we look at the errata, it's the C errata, so that was included. And you can double check the packages. Yep, penguin, shark, and walrus are the three that were copied over. Even though we didn't explicitly state them, we did say we wanted to include that errata, and that's gonna pull in any of the uh, yum packages that are indicated by that errata. So that gives you kind of a, a brief overview um, some of the functionality that we're working on. Thanks very much.